Voldemort's backstory plays a crucial role in understanding his descent into darkness, yet the Harry Potter movies offer a simplified version of his motivations compared to the books. In the films, Voldemort appears as a one-dimensional villain fueled by hatred for muggles and an insatiable thirst for power. However, J.K. Rowling's books present a far more complex and chilling portrayal of Voldemort, revealing how trauma and personal tragedy shaped him into the Dark Lord. In the movies, Voldemort's backstory is reduced to a few key moments, such as his time in the orphanage and his hatred for his father. While these glimpses provide context, they do not delve deeply into why Voldemort developed such an intense loathing for muggles or the internal struggles that drove him to darkness. This oversimplification makes Voldemort seem purely evil, born with a cruel nature, rather than a character shaped by his environment and experiences. The books, on the other hand, offer a more nuanced and humanizing look at Voldemort's past, his tragic family history, his pure-blood mother, Merope Gaunt, and his estranged muggle father, Tom Riddle, sets the stage for his obsession with power and purity. Conceived under a love potion, Voldemort was incapable of feeling love, a theme deeply explored in the books. His inability to love and his traumatic upbringing in a muggle orphanage sowed the seeds for his later hatred and quest for immortality. This deeper exploration of Voldemort's character makes him more terrifying in the books, as readers can empathize with his struggles while still being horrified by his choices. Rowling's portrayal of Voldemort allows us to see him not just as a villain, but as a product of his past, highlighting the complexity of good and evil in human nature.